Dan the Homestead. We are going to butcher our very first cow today. So I am getting breakfast started while um, Michael is getting everything prepared outside. We aren't going to show a lot of the butchering process because we've never done this before. So I'm going to have to be all hands on deck. Um, and eventually we'd like to do more like how-to videos and stuff. Lola, she's eating. She's a <laughs> wiggly eater. Anyways, um, eventually we'd like to do more how-to videos, but right now we are so in the learning stage and I don't have a way to like set my camera up to do view angles and stuff like that. So um, for right now it'll just be little snippets, but I am making apple cider donuts for breakfast. Uh, we got to get this quickly wrapped up so we can get out there and get um, the cow butchered before, well, it's going to be cold today, so there's no before the heat of the day or anything. <laughs> so the reason why we're butchering our cow today is um, we were going to butcher him in October anyways. That was our goal for him. He, we bought him and he is just, he was a bottle baby runt beyond runt and he has not grown a stitch and the last couple days we've noticed he's been losing weight since um, it's gotten colder so before we lose him altogether or lose too much weight it's time to get him taken care of but he is very very tiny like we could probably get more meat off of a deer but is what it is and we are gonna be grateful for what we get so I'm gonna get breakfast done. I'll show you what it looks like after. I've never made apple cider donuts before, so I'm kind of excited. I will for sure leave the recipe for these in the comments down below. These are amazing. Freshly homemade apple cider donuts. My hubby and bring him out one of these delicious treats. There he is. Ooh. Ooh. That's good. I have a donut. Good. Better than donut donut, right? Mm-hmm. Good. That is the most coziest sight in the whole wide world. I'm so thankful to have a fire again. Nothing like cook stove heat. Ooh, little bird that needs to go away from my chickens. Okay, I've got some compost here for the chickies, and they are going to be in heaven, of course. They love when we have compost. The ducks know I'm coming. Ducky, ducky, duckies. Look at them. Think they know what is going on. Come on here, boys. Are you, are you real excited? Are you real so excited? Oh, here comes some more. Here comes some more. I love giving my chickens compost. Just, you know, leftover stuff that we would have just thrown away and they love it and it's so good for them. Ducks don't really care so much about it. Got one adventurous duck. Yeah, cows! Come on, cows! Lily. <laughs> Lily! Come on, cows. Here, cows. It is so cold this morning. Is he? Good. This is my gorgeous girl. Lily. Okay, the deed is done on the cow. Um, we're now in the butchering process. We'll probably show you guys when we start to ground it, but I gotta go in and put the gun away, take care of Autumn really quick and then come back out and help Michael. The boys are already out there. Of course, boys are. It's cold. Okay, baby is nursed. I have a couple of them that don't want to come outside and, and be a part of all this business. Alyssa is not a fan. I'm coming. Alyssa is not a fan. Abby came out here for a few minutes. She said that she wanted to cut the cow. <laughs> and that she was a cowboy and she was gonna butcher it. And she came out here and was not too fond of the situation. So she came back in. And then Alyssa, like I said, she doesn't like these kind of situations. So she's staying inside and she's gonna watch the two little ones while I help Michael. 
We butchered our first cow. <laughs> Thank God we started with a little guy, but it was pretty easy. No kidding. Not, not too much unlike any game, deer or elk. Probably smaller than any elk I've ever seen. And <laughs> but he's done. Here he is in all his glory, all his tiny little glory. But you know what? We've got meat in our freezer, and that is a blessing. So we're very thankful to be able to do this ourselves and save a lot of money. Really, a lot of money. A lot of money. We didn't pay much for him. He was just a bottle baby. We had a nurse cow, so that was all free. And uh, I don't really see where we got much into him. He's totally worth it. It's going to be some very lean beef. But we like lean beef anyway, so that works it's all, out. It's all going to food. Yep. Good afternoon, friends. It is day two of the vlog. I was not able to film nearly as much as I wanted to yesterday. Uh, it was way too hands-on. Uh, Michael and I spent most of the day yesterday butchering the cow. Uh, and it was a lot more time consuming than we expected because, first of all, we knew that we were gonna make him into burger. Uh, and I guess that maybe in our heads we had planned on hanging him and then we decided you know what we're just making a burger so we might as well just get it done now so we got it done now <laughs> so we started butchering a little late I think it was like 8 o'clock when we started and um, ended pretty late in the afternoon it had already gotten dark on us which it's starting to get darker earlier now but it was pretty dark <laughs> so I had to come inside and still make dinner and we were just beat um, we were so thankful to have the children yesterday because they helped so much. But um, today is Friday, so I'm getting stuff ready for tomorrow. I'm cleaning up the kitchen. I'm making some bread in the cook stove. I made some uh, some oven, <laughs> some muffins yesterday, and we're gonna have tacos. And I'm gonna make enough for tomorrow as well. Um, and so. I just figured you could spend a little more time with us because the vlog wasn't going to be good enough. <laughs> just yesterday's like little snippets. Michael, right now I've got a fussing baby. Autumn, or Abigail is torturing her is what really is happening. She likes to walk over the top of her as she's crawling along and Autumn despises it. Michael is down below getting the hay put away in our barn. Heading down to get the rest of our hay under cover and the part of the carport that we just put together. And there it is. Windows got to break. Okay. So here is Part of the carport put up. We can get the whole thing put up. There's a lean to off the back. We don't have the walls on it yet, but we're not too worried about that. We could do that during the snow or whatever. Anyways, I just gotta finish moving the hay. There's the rest of it. Oh, probably. Probably about the same or just a hair less than what's in there. Maybe just a little less because we got a trailer full right now. Got a tarp up on the wall for now because it rained a couple days ago pretty good. Cows will just be feeding down here all winter. Except for Lily. We'll just kind of segregate her a little bit with her calf for a while from December. And there's our unfinished lean-to off the carport. And this is where they'll feed under. It's uh, 12 wide by 24 long, and we ordered it a little bit taller than that. The carport company messed up, so hopefully they'll be getting that stuff to us soon. We can get that part put up. And my bread is rising a little, little uneven. But that's okay. Bread 
is rising and it's gonna go in the oven. This is the warmest spot on the oven is right in the middle and I always keep my teapot up there and I always seem to have a pan because I melt butter all the time. Gonna have to take out the top rack, apparently. <laughs> well, that was supposed to be a little more graceful than I thought. <laughs> okay, take two. Ooh, pretty oven door that works. Ooh, gorgeous lumpy bread. <laughs> I just can't make that graceful. Oh well, see you in a little bit, bread. Did you take that apple? Did you take that apple? You're doing a pretty good job at it. She just stole an apple from the apple bin. She's seen Sissy eating one and wanted to eat one herself, huh? <laughs> I didn't do it. It's so good. Huh? I have Facebook. I don't have Facebook. There it is. Oh. Okay, got the dishes done. It has warmed up in our house significantly, so I've got the window open. My cheeks are probably super flush, but it is what it is. I have um, some chicken going on the cook stove now because I am going to make, uh, I'm going to can some chicken on Sunday, um, and I'm really excited to do that. These are our homegrown chickens, and then I'll make bone broth afterwards. My beautiful loaf of cricket bread. <laughs> I'm ready to take it out of the oven actually and let it cool up by the bread. Up by, up by the muffins. That is quite the <laughs> lumpy loaf of bread, but it looks and smells delicious. And is this not the most like beautiful busy sight ever? So pleased with this. I'm getting ready to make dinner. I'm gonna make tacos tonight. I think I might have said that. I need to make some salsa, which I'm always making salsa, it seems like on the vlog. <laughs> Um, and I've shared that recipe in another video and I will um, leave it in the cards above. And uh, I'm gonna make some banana bread for tomorrow. It's yummy. It's supposed to be for the, for the, what is it? Bread. bread. Banana bread, don't eat it. Keep mashing it. <gasps> no, no, that's for the bread. Did he take a bite of it? Yes. Stinker pot. I had to open the door. It got way too hot in here. And I gotta keep it open so I can get These my bacon These are definitely done. Andrews. They are Andrews. I'm 14, okay. 16. Yummy. So this is like a double chocolate banana bread. It's gonna be like dessert, my girlfriend said. I will leave the recipe for this in the description or in the comments of that's what I've been doing. Yum. This just smells like the most amazing cake, chocolate cake you ever had. My little ones mashed up the bananas and they didn't do as much as they should have, but that is okay because this is their help too. Okay, dinner is served. You can't see the meat underneath, but we gave you a shot of the meat. Looks delicious and the camera is not picking it up as good, but it is scrumptious. So that is dinner. We're having tacos and this delicious cake even though it's banana bread but we are going to end the vlog at that i hope that you guys enjoyed this video and we will catch you guys in our next one blessings and happy homesteading bye what? Did, you messy face? did you brush your teeth